Good evening, fellows. How's it going? Pitt lost to Cincinnati 45-44. The difference being a botched point after touchdown where the holder dropped the ball. One point. One point between a BCS game, well, overtime, the chance to play for a BCS game, and now a not-so-very-nice fate with a bowl game. Tonight's, today's loss mostly came down to, in my opinion, ex extremely poor special teams play. I mean, the unbotched point after touchdown being the big big thing, but a kickoff return for a touchdown by Cincinnati, and then a short, they pit, did a short kickoff the next time to keep the ball away from the kick returner, but instead of kicking it actually really high, it was a short kick, but it was a low kick, so he was able also able to get a good return on that because we just couldn't set up the blocking. This comes down to execution more than anything. I mean, if we're going to say that the um, WVU loss it came down to more of the blame should go to the coaching because the team just didn't come out right, didn't play right. This one comes down more to execution, just especially on special teams, especially on defense not making a stop when they had to make the stop at the end of the game. I don't know. I'm just I'm still a little cold from the game. And so first really cold game of the year. Um So I really don't have a whole a lot I feel like saying. I mean, I've heard some people complaining that the offensive play calling was bad for the first time that they the play calling was bad. And I, I disagree with that. I definitely think the best strategy against Cincinnati was to give the ball off to Dion Lewis a lot and run it down their throats. I thought that was a fairly effective thing to do. So, I'm not complaining about the play calling. I'm just sad now because I feel like this season has a lot of parallels to 2003. A lot of hope, a lot of optimism, but then the team faltered at the end. And now Pitt's going to be given a bowl game that Pitt fans are just not going to want to go to. I hope it's Charlotte. It wouldn't surprise me if it wasn't. If it was Birmingham. I mean, that's sad. They had a they had a good year, but they blew it at the end. So they got to take care. They got to deal with that. Bummer, ain't it? Well, I don't. I haven't heard heard who, where, the, where the bowl invite is, so just that there probably will be one. I assume that will be coming down tomorrow. I know WVU got the gate. WVU got the, its Gator Bowl invite right after beat Rutgers today. So who knows? It's just disappointing. That's all.